So now I want to talk about blastomycosis, which is caused by Blastomyces dermatitidis. Um, and basically you see this. Uh, let's talk about a clinical vignette here. Um, it's a fungus. Okay, and you see it in states. Uh, let me try and draw America here. I uh, miss Texas down there. So this is America. And this is the Mississippi River. Um, so you see it in states east of the Mississippi River and excluding the Ohio River Valley. Um, this is a very poorly drawn United States. Um, but the Ohio River Valley is down here, and that's where you see Histo. Um, and then the south, in the southwest, you see Cocyoids. Okay. Um, near the San Joaquin River Valley. Um, okay. Um, so basically, it's a fungus, and it causes pneumonia. Um, and it causes granulomatous pneumonia. Um, you see these granulomas formed, um, and they are caseating. Uh, so you have to differentiate between histoplasma, uh, TB, um, but it doesn't have any person-to-person -person transmission like TB does. Um, by the way, you give isoniazid for TB uh, prophylaxis. Um, and the thing you want to look at is broad-based budding, and that's the biggest thing. Um, so maybe they'll give you a picture that looks like this where you have these fungi separating, and they're like, what is it? Where do you see it? Um, you see east of the Mississippi, and you see broad-based budding yeast. Okay. And it kind of looks like that. I mean, not really. It's very poorly drawn. Um, but basically, it causes granulomatous nodules in the lung, and, however, it can disseminate to the skin and bone. Um, so wrapping up here, you see um, someone who gets a, a, a pneumonia east of the Mississippi, um, or they give you a picture uh, that kind of looks like broad-based budding, or they talk about broad-based budding. Um, I don't really think they'll talk about the skin and bone dissemination, um, but east of the Mississippi and broad-based budding. Um, and basically you treat it with uh, ketoconazole um, for a local infection, uh, or fluconazole for a local infection, and amphotericin B is for a systemic infection. So fluke and keto uh, for local. And amphotericin B, you just uh, you put it in IV and it gets rid of all the funguses. So amphotericin systemic. And that's about it.